in this section we'll talk about how do i deploy the changes from my local to the salesforce org and how do i retrieve the changes from the salesforce org to my local in case if we wanted to represent this in a pictorial form i can take two boxes this box i can name it as salesforce org the org that i'm authorized the vs code to connect and this is my vs code so currently there is a bidirectional connection that has happened bet between these two applications so if i want to get something from my salesforce org to my vs code that is what we call it as retrieve and in case if i want to move the changes that are in my vs code that is the local folder structure that i have to the salesforce org that is where we we call it as deploy retrieve is like downloading the changes to your local from the salesforce org and deploy is something that uploading the changes that i have in my vs code local to the salesforce org the official name that is given to this process where we upload the changes from vs code to the salesforce org is called deploy the other vice versa is called as retrieval process so keep that image in mind when we are talking about retrieve and deploy how do i retrieve the changes so initially we'll start off with the retrieval process and then we'll understand how do i deploy the changes now if you see here there is a salesforce icon that i can see towards my left hand side once my authorization of the org is completed now what is the advantage of this icon here this icon helps us connect with that org and get the metadata that i want so if you see here as soon as i click on this one it says no default org is set for the vs code to pick up the latest changes i am clicking on this refresh icon here at the top it should ideally be showing me the list of metadata that i have to the org that i am connected to so if i see here i have all the metadata that i would need starting from my apex classes apex triggers i'm just calling out few things if you can see all the metadata that is available in the org i can fetch that information here so we have custom tabs we have custom objects we have custom object translations all the things that we have in the salesforce we can pull that as a metadata into my local org so we'll just do with a simple exercise where i wanted to fetch a class that is there in my org before i go ahead and do that i just go to the salesforce org and show you the apex classes that i have so i am on my salesforce org i'm i'm searching for the apex classes that i have click on that link where it would show me the list of classes that i have in my org so i have acc and contact wrapper class i have apex demo class i have apex super practice one the class that i'm interested in pulling the changes from my salesforce org to my vs code is this class i can do it on any class i'm just taking this class as a reference so that i can show that process of retrieval using my vs code that has been authorized so this is the class that i'm interested in that i wanted to pull the changes from my salesforce org to my local folder structure so i'm again back on my vs code if you see here my point of interest at this point of time is to retrieve the class that i have shown you in the salesforce org so if i open this folder apex class folder that is where i can see the class that i am interested in if you see here this is the same class that i have shown you in the ui and i can see the same thing here as well in case if you want to retrieve this changes all you need to do is just click on this download button or a icon that says on hover it says retrieve source from the org i'm retrieving the changes from the source org the source org is nothing but the salesforce org that this vs code is connected to i'll click on this one again a command has been initiated which is saying that the retrieve source from the org is successfully ran and this is the command that it is been using right the command it is using is sftx retrieve source from the org that got ended and i was able to retrieve this class that i have talked about Hey guys if you like this video do like share and subscribe to SFTC Quest